from the Happiness Bank and welcome to my weekly video blog. Decided that I would move the set outside into the great outdoors today because it's such gorgeous weather and I thought you might like a change of scenery too. So here we are. I want to talk to you today about some personal commitments that I've made to myself. And obviously it's all around being happy and healthy at the same time. So I thought I would share them with you. I was reflecting on whether I live my life in accordance with who I really want to be. And in the most part, I was pretty happy, but I knew that there was room for improvement. So I got a pen and paper and I decided that I would write a list of all the things that I should be doing or would be doing if I was living my life um, as a person that I truly wanted to be. And I came up with my top 12 and I called these my 12 personal commitments. And I knew that if I fulfilled these commitments every day then I would always be living or striving to live the life that I wanted to be and to be the person that I truly wanted to be. So I thought I would share them with you and here they are, my 12 personal commitments. Number one, be kind and not right. Two, no whinging. Three, love, don't judge. Number four, help others. Five, be grateful. Six, be kind to myself. Seven, accept and then let go. Eight, if it's not helpful, don't focus on it. Number nine, exercise every day. 10, live life on purpose. 11, shine brightly. And number 12, be clear. I believe happiness comes from within and when you are living in accordance with the person that you truly want to be and that is your true essence minus your ego leading you astray then I know you will be happy. Can I encourage you to have a go at writing down your 12 personal commitments? Start off with a big list first off and then pick your top 10 or your top 12. Read them out loud to see whether they truly resonate with who you want to be. And then make sure you write that list down and have it with you every day, like have it by your bedside table so that when you wake up every morning, you can revisit them and read them to start your day off on the right foot. That way I know that you will constantly strive to be living in accordance with who you truly want to be. It's really quite liberating and um, it keeps you on track. Thank you so much for joining me once again. I truly love having you here with me every week. And I know that if we all continue to strive to be healthier and happier, then we're gonna color this world um, with health and happiness. And it's gonna be a heaps better place for all of us to live in. I look forward to seeing you next week.